Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to clean and remove the GE fabric, um, fabric cut softener dispenser. So here it is right here. Now, have you ever taken one of these off before? Um, if not, I'll show you how here. So there's a little line here. And what you're going to want to do is I just take a flathead um, screwdriver and you just kind of put it under the line here. In this model, you can kind of pry it open and just move it around. Um, you can see here how we're making some progress. You wanna just go ahead and pry and kind of move um, the agitator along and it'll kind of pry itself. Um, as you can see, it's kind of coming up there. And so once it's loose, you just pop it off here. And this, this one has never been cleaned as far as I know. It looks pretty gross, um, as you can see there. And you can, there's, there's two pieces in this top cup here i was just using a flathead to remove it and as you can see inside it's got all kinds of kind of grime and um, fabric softener old fabric softener in there so i'm going to clean those later um, in the sink so as you can kind of see here looking a, a little bit closer in this um, inside part here it's pretty it's got black and all kinds of gunk in it here. So as you can kind of see, that's pretty gross. So I'm just going to use some paper towels and go ahead and um, clean it up here. So I'm using kind of like a bleach spray to just kind of loosen everything up and get it all I, I don't know if it's mold or not in there but i just sprayed some bleach cleaner just in case but it's probably just grime and dirt attaching to the old fabric softener that's gunked up in there but either way um we'll get it out here we're making some progress here and it does help to wear gloves um, and as you can see it's a lot cleaner it has some little holes on the bottom so what we've done here is we've got the two separate parts. I've cleaned those off in the um, sink, and there's little lines here on the side. You want to line those up with the fabric dispenser cup here, and it just goes down. You can hear it click. So th there we go. All set. Um, go ahead and check out the other video here, and I'll be doing another video soon.